Next chapter. This is the game. She is dead, right, bro? Oh, yeah, I just read that. This is the game. Yeah, I'm so confused. Um, what what outfit are we feeling? I, 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 I low-key like the red. I'm, I low-key vibe with the red. Ooh, to get a cat? Yeah, I'm not paying extra money to get a fucking cat. I'm not paying extra money to get a cat. Whoa, what was that? What's that word? Penumbra? What the fuck's a penumbra? What the fuck is happening? You rewind a time again. Well, it doesn't sound like the call was no big deal. It sounds like it was important to you. Sophie's alive. Did I... Did I actually manage to rewind time? Mac, are you okay? It kind of seems like you're on drugs. Oh, uh, cause I am. Oh. I wish. Mm. Just happy you're here. That seems kind of circle. No, I'm just. The mum's here. We can't joke about drugs. Really happy you're here with me. <laughs> so, drugs then. Sorry. Yeah, uh, Coke. Sorry. What were we talking about? Somebody mentioned the phone call? Mm, yes. I was shocked too. I didn't know people still answered their phones. Funny, Mom. And yeah, it wasn't a big deal. It was just from the publisher. Right. Your book. The secret book. I'm so proud of my girl. Cocaine for you. Publishing yeah. is always such a difficult endeavor. Thanks, Mom. No one going to take our order? It's been like a few minutes. Have you ever had a food service job? Like, ever? I can go ask. I can go ask what the holdup is, Yasmin. No sweat. See? That is so thoughtful of you, Maxine. No need. The whole place could use a facelift, to be honest. Wait, chill. Come on, Yasmin. You don't have anywhere else to be? I need to ask Sophie about... God, where do I even start? What is that? Oh no. Oh shit. Dude, your nose. It's fine. Just a God damn sure I like you cut G. Um back in a second. Bro, how did you not I, I I got the how did you not notice last night? I I had this hair wet cut nearly a week now. Bro uh, bro, I got that low taper thing. No, I'm just joking. Actually, no, I actually think I actually did get a low tape of it. I don't know. All I said to the barber was make me look good. So he gave me this. <laughs> I walked in the barber shot and I was like, yo, G, cut my hair. And he's like, gotcha. And this is what he gave me. What well, the fuck? I didn't. Well, well, to be fair, the lights were off. You couldn't tell. Yo, what's up, Amanda? Wow. I thought you got lost in a blizzard. You dropped your phone down a bottomless pit. Something. Uh, lost? No. You're right, I'm being passive aggressive. Sorry. It's just... You asked me out and then ignored my text for 48 hours. Kinda sucked is all. Oh, so, so I asked you out. I mean, that's how I interpreted it when you stood there two nights ago and said you wanted to go on a date. Two nights ago is exactly when I asked Amanda out. 
So I haven't gone back in time. Yo, good news. My gamma oh, call play is nearly complete. This Amanda Damn. never talked to me about slowing down our relationship. Because Sofi isn't dead. So are you gonna tell me what happened? You should tell her. I was hung over. I was working. Okay. If I used the I was working uh scenario, I could get away with it. Hung over wouldn't work. Working. Shit. I was working. I get total runaway train tunnel vision sometimes. I'm so sorry. Hmm. The old I'm a serious artist excuse. I didn't mean to make you feel like crap. Hey. Shit happens. I won't bug you about it. Just didn't But why the camera is freezing? I should get back to work. Really? There's, there's no way two nights in a row my stream is about my stream is fucking lagging now. There's no way there's absolutely no way my stream is going to crash again for the second night in a row. Yeah, GG's. You know, GG's, my, my stream may crash. It may or may not crash. It may or may not crash. Take it easy, eh? So if I didn't rewind, this is some kind of alternate reality. But I still talked to Amanda two days ago. So far, everything here seems basically the same. So this is my original timeline. So this is my actual timeline. I was hoping my nosebleed days were behind me. It feels connected to that humming and whatever caused it. Oh, so that's what the two circles made now. I can shift timelines? Whoa! Holy shit. I'm, I'm back, aren't I? In dead world, this is so fucking crazy. That's what a name, dead world. That is a name for it, dead world. Max, you're here. I'm here. Surprise. You good? Uh, thanks to you. I'm okay. You really cheered me up earlier. Happy to line up my comedic stylings to girls in need. <laughs> thanks. Are you here for... Not me for Cooch, I'm the... Fuck! We already talked in her office. She seems to be doing... You know... Bad. God knows. I offered her free coffee for as long as she wants it. I gotta get back to it. Don't forget I'm here for you, okay? Thanks. So God much. speed, pilgrim. Okay, I'm going back to the other timeline. Fuck this timeline. This timeline's the worst. So I can actually just shift realities. Okay, so I can cross back and forth. That's good to know. Yeah, well, well, Sophie and Yasmin are probably wondering where I am. Okay, I Max, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you right now, there's no need to use any of those fucking powers. Honestly, Just stay in this timeline and relax. Was getting around to it. All clear? We don't need to get you a blood transfusion. Shut up. I like it better when you're dead. I'm sorry. That that that's too soon been happening a lot. Nothing to worry about. Oh, I'm golden. Probably just the weather, you know? Oh, did the forecast call for massive nosebleeds? No, the w forecast calls for some paranormal bullshit. Duty calls. Send me the bill for the windshield, please, Safia. Windshield? 
wouldn't you? Another piece of shit pie. Someone... Hold on, it's easier if I just show you. Jesus. What the fuck? Fuck, Zoppy. Is that your car? Charming, right? Found it this morning. Well, if, what if that's a threat? Do you have any idea who did it? No. But if I ever find out, it's on site. <laughs> yeah! You couldn't have picked a fight with the Volvo instead? This is gonna sound bananas, but... I feel like I've met this cow. You have. It's from right over there. <sighs> Whatever, I gotta meet the tow truck. Wait. Hold on. The broken horn. It looks like there was something written on it. Max, you know I adore you, but... Room, bud. I'm not didn't the mood. Just <laughs> hesitated. Yeah, sorry. Investigate the cow skull. Fuck yeah, I'll investigate the cow skull. Oh wait, so that's how I can. So what if I went into dead reality? Hey, Amanda. I have. She pretty Safi died. Oh, she's alive. Do you ever have non weird questions? Sometimes. Occasionally. On a leap year. The whole year or just February 29th? Now who's asking weird questions? <sighs> Alright, hit me then. What's the question? Have you had any skulls go missing lately? Wow. Um, um, I definitely didn't kill anyone. That's an extremely specific question. And I can't believe the answer is yes. Our only skull, in fact. I'm dying to know why you ask. Because it somehow ended up in Sophie's windshield. Uh, wait, what the fuck? Are you serious? Why did yeah. you take so long to say something? To the mystery. Jesus. A skull? I mean, have they never heard of a brick? Yeah, I, I, I've got one right now. If you know what I mean. Literally just this morning, before I clocked in. It had to be sometime last night. Did you see anything suspicious? I mean... The Abraxas kids are perpetually suspicious. They took up like six tables last night. Yeah, it was one of them, GG's. Maybe one of them saw something. Hell, maybe one of them stole it. Thanks. I appreciate the info. Anytime, Nancy Drew. Who's Nancy Drew? Does anyone who know, does anyone know who Nancy Drew is? Because I have zero clue. Am I meant to know who oh, that is? It's just, you know, a doorway to Dead World. Shut up. Oh, that's... Dead World. Oofa doofa. That's gonna take some getting used What did to. she just say? Amanda is cheating on us? Yeah, GG. It's all over now. Oh, hi, Miss Caulfield. I'm sorry for your loss. Huh? You were close to Safi. Right? Does she not know we're in Dead World? I should have asked permission. Fuck. Size does matter. <laughs> we are to be here, folks. GG's to all of us men. Sure GG's. Where was that? Well, GG's. We are to here. You are to here first. We're cooked. We don't need a step ladder. Bro, why? Yo, <laughs> she said it. Size matters. No, honey, I love it. I do. Moses? As ever. Where? That should help me reach the cow skull. What should? What should help you reach the fucking. Oh. That should help me reach the cow skull. 
Oh, so I can see into the living world. Oh, okay, this is kind of cool. That's the way back across. Am I taking this with me or am I just going to put it up there? Okay, where am I hiding the step stool? <laughs> it's not. Am I. Is it in my bag? Oh, that's just, you know, a doorway. I keep clicking the wrong button. Oofa doofa, that's something I've never heard. I've never heard that either, too. I'm, I was. That was clueless. That went right. That went right over my head. Oofa doofa. Are these pickup lines the same? If I can't get on here, I will face God and walk backwards into hell. I'm a computer. Can I crash at your place tonight? You're looking good today. Want snacks? You must be topping the charts because you're the hottest single this week. Where is it? Uh, uh, roses are red, uh, violets are blue. Here's a fun fact, your girlfriend's taller than you. That makes no sense. Um... Uh, did you get those pants 50% off because they're 100% off at my place? <laughs> Roses are red, hot dogs be slapping. When I pull out my wiener, that's when the magic happens. There we go. Put me on the chalkboard now. That is... <laughs> that is my pick up line. <laughs> Put me on the chalkboard. Put me in, coach. He brought it out. <laughs> I brought... I, brought I, I had to blow the dust off it. Been collecting dust. Lucas. I can barely read it. Lucas Colmenero. Lucas Colmenero. Oh shit! Did Lucas throw this through her window? That's Who brought out the even book. less likely than the Abraxas kids. Maybe they were in it together. This doesn't make any sense. It doesn't. I don't even know where the story is going right now. I'm having a good time. Like any Life is Strange game. Okay, why is she in Dead World? I need to think. What is going on? You can travel through realities. I mean, she kind of did that in the first game, did she not? When she uh, made Chloe into a Hot Wheels car. Okay. Oh, notes. We need to explain who it's the killer or Sophie. I okay. Here, here is my theory on who killed Safi. Um, obviously she's not dead, but obviously in this reality she is. But I have a feeling it's Gwen. Gwen and Lucas teamed up, or maybe in the reality where she's alive, it's go. She is going to get bapped. So we have to try and protect her and figure out how to prevent her death. Um. I have a big stupid crush. Um, film student Moses T. A. Jr. Abraxin comes to my seminars. Okay. Creative nonfiction professor, Safi's mentor, author of It's the Highway Should Take Me as Its Wife. What? what? Loretta, journalism student, sophomore, occasionally comes to my seminars, true crime podcaster, blackmailer, annoying, avoid. Yeah, she seems... She is the new Victoria of this game, and I'm out to kill her. Professor, department, chair, literature, best-selling author of the world. Yeah, he, this dude right here is giving off Jefferson vibes from the first game. Maybe it's Drake and the stake in his pants fall. <laughs> hey, that's me. Hey, Drake! 
grad student, astrophysicist, Sappy's best friend, my acquaintance. Your acquaintance? Reggie. Uh, Safi, Vin, Yasmin. Okay. Yeah, well, well, we got Drake, though. Did I see Chloe on the phone? Nah. Well, there, there, there is photos of her. She is, she is, Chloe is in the game, but she's dead. Oh wait, uh, hi Max, uh, um, he needs time. My gut tells me it's not good news. Uh, Safi Safi, I think we should talk. Did you mean to text me? Yeah, why has been calling me Safi? Y'all, it's him! It's him! Sorry, that's... Things got a mind of its own. Thinking of Safi again, huh? How could Vin mix... Vin has a crush on me. What if it's not just a prank? What if this Safi is in danger too? She probably is. I just got her back. At least I know where Oh, damn. Yeah, see, at least the beginning of the game, it asked you, um, they, Safi asked about Chloe, and you could either say that, uh, you, you, like, wait, no longer friends, or you just slowly faded away, or she dead. I just straight up said she dead. She is. She dead. Dead to me. So am I still in the dead world? Vin's the head honcho of Abraxas. I should cross over and see if he's around. Maybe I should do a little digging into Gwen Hunter, too. She was acting pretty odd earlier. Yeah, because she did it. I should cross over and start asking questions. Whoever oh, so I have to speak to Living World version. Gonna out themselves. Open up the doorway. Now, if I were a bovine vandal, a what? where would I... There's Vin. If it was a Braxis that stole the cow skull, they might have done it on Vin's orders. Would he though? Would they have done? Uh-oh. And, uh, don't get cute, either. You find it, you bring it right back to me. Well, go! Find it! Yeah, he definitely did it. He definitely threw it. Undergrads, <laughs> am I right? Uh, can't live with them. Hey, you were a kid once. Like you were never young. <laughs> young, yes. Young, um, dumb, maybe. and full of cum. I'm Suffering. sorry. I'm sorry. Never. Somebody Never. call the cops. Is certainly a word. You lose something? Mostly my patience. Okay. Hey, I. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Cute banter. Barely restrained sexual tension. Etc. I'm busy, Max. Another time. Wow. Okay. I'm not what trying to flirt with you. have been looking for? Let's say I find your missing patients. Then I wouldn't be busy anymore, would I? I found it. <laughs> it's on my phone. In the North Quad? How am I meant to know what the North Quad is? Is this not the North Quad? Oh, hold up, what you say? Yo, chill. I said nothing. You're hallucinating, my brother. 
That's definitely not getting clipped and getting fed on TikTok. In her office. And I think Lucas has a habit of working over by the cafe. Okay, North Quad is 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 physically here. So Diamond's out here somewhere. And why does that sound like a who would name your who would name your child Diamond? Let's be real. Why name Diamond? That sounds like a stripper. Diamond just straight straight up sounds like a stripper name. Not lying. Not gonna lie. Yellow snow. Um, it's no, it's only yellow because someone took a piss there. Can I not look at fuck? Okay, fuck you. Yo, so where's Diamond? Diamond is nut. Ben seems really distracted. Whatever he lost. What do you mean by that? Important. Snow David. David who? Fucking Madsen. Um. Why are there a point here? Gutch. Uh, here she is. Waiting for someone, Dan? Mm-hmm. Moses. He asked me to help him carry snacks back to the lab, but I guess he forgot. Isn't that kind of menial for a TA? So my job is menial now? I didn't. I'm fucking with you. No, you're not. <laughs> Drake nah, Moses ops. probably just got distracted off polishing his new telescope. If it were anyone but him, I'd ask if that was a euphemism. I can see a <laughs> brony naming the kid Diamond. Your wife is chased through his collar! Praxis kids are really staring, huh? That one on the left is super into me. I danced with him once, once at a club last week. I don't see the appeal. <laughs> Can I get it? That yeah. snake is getting freaky. I mean, I was just looking to dance. If I wanted more, he would not be my first choice. Besides, they're on the clock for Vin now. Probably trying to catch me in unabraxis-like behavior. Unabraxis-like? What even qualifies as unabraxis-like? Let's see. Sincerity, brokenness, or the hint of brokenness. Oh, and challenging Vin's authority. I think... Vin's lost something. It's clearly rattled him. I'll, uh, go ask the goon squad. Hey, the goon squad! So when's gooning hour for everyone? When does gooning hour start for you guys? They have our man and he knows too much. Hey. I heard the first hey, time. Hey, so Diamond told me she doesn't feel comfortable with you two staring at her. You tell me what Ven's looking for, and I won't tell him you're skeeving on a fellow Abraxas member. Good the talk. snake squad, I mean the goon squad. There has to be some way I can hear what they're saying I should see what those Abraxas goons are up to. Whoa. Oh wait, there is a way! I think I just oh my god my IQ needs to be fucking studied in a lab There is a way to hear what they're saying I, I keep clicking the wrong button We do this We go to dead we go dead world Like the rats yeah Did you just call me a rat? Vin seems really distracted Whatever he lost must be important. Holy shit! Someone took Vin's phone, and they think it was Diamond. Gotcha I two times this day. <laughs> That, yeah. 
first of December, that's when... The first of December is when wanking hour begins. So you've got to wait. you got to wait a first whole month just as... I was just asking for a time of day. I didn't realize that you only do it once a year, man. That's patience and dedication. So, if you're wondering why those Abraxas kids are eyeballing you, it's because someone stole Finn's phone. Oh, seriously? They think it was me? <laughs> yeah, because no, none of them. I can't risk the it. <laughs> Fair enough. Of course they do. Of course. <laughs> I knew it wasn't you. I take it I was right to assume they're full of shit. Always a safe assumption. But if you find out who did it, tell them I owe them a drink. Uh. That's all. I'm not gonna ask any more questions. Okay. Cool. Thanks, Diamond. And hey. If you talk to Vin again, tell him the only thing I'm taking from him is his crown. Damn. Yo, so then, um, fuck you. Fuck you, Simulu. So. Fuck you, Shang Chi. Bad news? I'm not sure who took your phone. Good news? It was a diamond. Holy shit! You figured all that out with like zero tools. I just knew who to ask. Imagine Max teach you in a class. And how? I I wouldn't be listening. So. About my question. Nine, three, Tuesday, after seven, and I'm partial to a Japanese single malt. That's whiskey. <laughs> I'm not asking you out, my guy. Yeah. I have so much to teach you, so you're placing mine. Get him away from me now! Tempting? No, don't flatter yourself, my guy. Sounds like a profoundly underwhelming Don't knock it till you've tried it. I. <laughs> Did he really just say don't so, knock it till you try it? Someone fucked up Zoppy's car. They didn't take anything, but they used a cow skull to do it. Jesus. Max, that's crazy. Is she okay? She's fine. Who would do something like that, though? You mean, who in Abraxas would? Not exactly. Well, yeah. It's esoteric enough to feel like the handiwork of your uh, organization. A cow skull. <laughs> what are we, Leonard Skinner? Come on, this one is way outside our wheelhouse. Anytime some nonsense happens on campus, people trip over themselves accusing Abraxas. Vandalism, destruction of property, that's beneath us, Max. What the form of this? There was some theatrical. Only the audience knew that. The audience wasn't in. That's how you know it wasn't us. And besides, how do you even get a cow skull through a windshield? Hold on. I didn't say anything about our windshield. Why? Right? Ah! Uh, he got cooked. And if I need to reach you? I'll end up in my office eventually. He's cooked. He just... Nah, he fucked hey, up. What did you do? 
glad my other suspects had the sense to stay indoors. Yeah, what an idiot. I didn't say anything about a windshield, and he went straight for windshield. Bro got caught in 4K. Man got caught lacking. <laughs> I just said a cow skull was uh went through Sophie's uh, Sophie's car. I didn't say windshield. <laughs> Man just assumed. Um. Alexa, Alexa play Despacito. You give me a second. Hey, Surely it's number one smoker. Isn't going to taint the building with my presence. Just leave everything behind, Professor. You won't need any we university caught materials. We got wet or uh, hemi down. Yeah, <laughs> but I do need my car keys if you want me to leave the campus, don't I? Think. Yeah, think. You're not to return to Caledon property before the hearing under penalty of law. I know how this works. You don't need to read me my rights. Just doing my job, Professor. That'll go over great in Nuremberg. This is crazy. This is fucking crazy. I told Yasmin already that none of it's true. She knows it's fucking bullshit. Wow. This is all just I guess some something kind of crazy screwy is going thing. down here, too. But at least... She left her door wide Eesh. open. I wonder what that... So this Gwen just got escorted out by security. While Dead World Gwen is having hushed phone calls about the police and trying to break into locked bookcases. Yeah, sounds kind of sus. Snoop like I've never snooped before. Gwen's wife. Ah! Uh, I met her at a faculty event last month. That's why she's a smoker. She adores her. She has a wife. Whoa, Reggie got an A minus. Loretta doesn't seem like the type yeah, fuck Loretta. You would never do what, Gwen? What is this about? Yeah, what is this about? Gwen canceled her weekly meetings with Sophie. Why? They're planning to kill her. So it's. They're killing- they're planning on killing her. Mm. Okay, let's check the- let's check the tasks. Search Gwen's desk? Did I not just do that? Oh wait, here we go. No, there's some clue hiding in here. I had decided I would hitchhike across the country. If I still wanted to die when I got to the Pacific, then I could do it peacefully. What the hell? Hell of an opening line, Gwen. Yeah. You become an author. Wait, never mind, you are, already are. There's nothing here. I'm going to read this, I swear. Pleasure reading again. Um, there's something in the dead world. Plant and fly. Here we go. If Sophie was an undergrad, this reading must have been at least what four years ago. Drink up, buddy. Hey, she said the line from the first game. She said the thing. Impressive book collection. Fiction, non-fiction, poetry, plays. What the fuck is that? That's a, that's a pretty cool book stopper. Live fast, eat ass. <laughs> Why words? Wise words. Whatever, what do you mean whatever they mean? There's practically saying it, it is what it is. Eat, live fast, eat ass. Gwen seemed very focused 
between Glenn and caked up Mothman, goaded with the sauce. Goaded with the sauce. God, why didn't I trade travel stories with Gwen before all this? <laughs> Have you reacted to the album that Tyler of the Creator release? Don't tell me. No, please don't tell me that's true. Please don't. Please tell me you're joking. Please tell me you're joking. These emails are from way... I knew Gwen mentored Safi, but I didn't realize she was this involved. I'm not all oh my fucking god, there is no way. Uh, how do I read it? Oh, here we so go. Gwen is asking questions about Sophie's death. Why would Sophie have started acting off on Friday? Something must have happened. Find out what happened on Friday? Why yeah. would Sophie have started acting off on Friday? That must have been some call with Maria on Friday. Friday. Semester ends, when please, Candy D. Stupid motherfucking call with Maria. Find out what Gwen talked about to Maria. Alright, Hacker Max. Let's go. Search sent to Maria. Uh, enter. Wait. This is Safi's publisher. Gwen got Safi's book cancelled? What? So it could have been a suicide then. If Gwen got Safi's book cancelled, it could have been suicide. These emails are from way back. Like, before Safi knew she wanted to be a poet. I knew Gwen meant... I thought Gwen helped Safi set this all up in the first place. Why would she? Jealousy. No, this all has to add up. Somehow. And GG's, we just broke the law. Lucas tends to work over by the cafe. Hey, you're right. Going to the national. That's Lucas there, but your grandfather would have been proud. Here we go. Yo, that Moby Dick. Max Caulfield. 1995. Don't what? 1995? Yo, wait, what? I should talk to Lucas about the other night. 2013. She was born in 1995. Never mind. I'm just dumb. Max. No, that's Gobby Nick. <laughs> yo, what? Yo, was he watching porn? Sorry. Busy, busy. Um. Need something? Actually, I. Catherine. I've been waiting for an hour. No, just put Robbie on. Oh, sure. I'm only the boy's father. Who fucking cares, right? How can you say... Whoa. Adds a whole new meaning to nuclear family. If Lucas has it out for Safi, there might be something incriminating in that case. Bet. Is 
is that an email? Dated December 5th. That's when Sophie's car was vandalized. I need to get in that briefcase. Just yank the paper out. Speak to Dead World Lucas, but busy, busy, more like busy, busy while playing with the. <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, did Bobby, you see, split. um, uh -huh. next year they're releasing a studio series, too, uh, Bumblebee, Weird. and it's the this Beatles on the Bumblebee yeah. movie? Terms with his family. Hey. Bye. Lucas. Max. It's been a hard day. Yeah. How are you feeling? Confused. I'm feeling a lot of stuff all tangled together. It's hard to parse. When my dad passed, well, grief is an easy country to get lost in. No matter how many times you visit. That's a lot of books. Oh yeah, I heard about that. They're a lot doing... of my book. Yeah, Signed yeah, they're doing a studio the series 86 Expo. Devastator in the first They invited oh, me to deliver the keynote this year. it's Scrap Heap comes out Have next year. Have you seen year. the standee they put up of me? Alan, wait! Can't say I have. Huh. Yeah, I might have to reposition it then. The standards for the Expo really declined over the years. <laughs> We've had a lot of mediocre Yikes. visitors. This dude can talk. It's a shame. How am I but gonna get that here? Years and years and years, people still love the characters. Oh crap! I forgot. I, what time is it? <laughs> I have to go give something to Moses. Um, <coughs> before his class. Good luck with the book expo. That could have not been any more cringe. I have an idea. I have an idea. Let me cook. Let me cook. Watch me cook. Fuck, it's not there. Um... That's only in the dead world. Fuck. Don't let me cook. Take me away from the oven. The cow school had Lucas's name on it. He might know something. Oh, there's also a little thing over here, too. Yes, I was a shitty father in the past, but I've never intentionally hurt our son. I would never. Hmm. I'm confused. I bet Lucas would really hate if something happened to this. Now, what could I use ah. to do some permanent damage? Um, I don't know. What could you use? What if I ordered some coffee? From the other world. Why is he having a skull for a balloon? Last night I finished. Yo, that's me. That like I was saying, last night I finished uh, Octodad. Lucas is usually in the cafe at this time. No, I can't. I can't order coffee. Fuck. I finished playing Octodad last night, right? And let me tell you, 
I never wanted to kill myself more than playing that game. That game wanted me to end it all. What the fuck is this shit? That coke. I know your pain. Wait, have you played it? Oh wait, there's a fucking marker right here. Dare I channel my inner Chloe? Hey, Chloe reference. Now, how exactly do I want to get under Lucas's skin? Black eye? Nah, no, devil. The classics are classics for a reason. Oh my goodness! Who would do a thing like this? Someone should tell Lucas right away. Didn't I just say I had to leave? She returns. I take it you've delivered your... something to Moses? My something? Right, my something. Yep, something delivered. <laughs> so, not to be the bearer of bad news, but... Somebody drew horns in a tail on your book, Expo Standee. Are you serious? I just put that... Come on! Yeah, that was definitely not me. Some people just have no respect for other people's <laughs> Fucking A. A, Max. Come on, stupid marker. I keep... I keep clicking the wrong button. Now time to get in here. How does he how does he not see this? Lucas's famous book. So that explains the cow skull and the snapping turtle. But does that mean he's the one who smashed Sophie's windshield? Lucas was with his agent last night, not the snapping turtle. He couldn't have vandalized Sophie's car. So, no point in looking through Lucas's who stuff did? now. Satisfying though it is. Sophie? What? Temporary restraining order on Sophie. GG's. Is Lucas really trying to file a restraining order against Sophie? Does she know about this? I'd better show her. What's this game? It's Life is Strange. The new Life is Strange Max? game. What are you... Ah, GG's. Lucas. I had a feeling this, this is gonna happen. You can't tell her. What? What? You can't send Sophie that photo. Why? Give me Let a me reason. Explain. Okay. Please. Catherine, my ex-wife, she Wait, called like, last night, about? mad as hell, because uh, Robbie, drama. our son, was repeating back to her things I supposedly told him, but I never... I mean, I could never... The shit Robbie says I told him, it, it... It makes me sick to think about. Was... Robbie lying? Maybe he was making it up? Acting out for attention. No. No. 
Even if Robbie was the type, this shit, I mean, where would a kid even get ideas like that? He told her, I said he was the reason for the divorce. And somehow that was the least fucked up thing I'm purported to have said. This still doesn't explain the restraining order. Yeah, it doesn't. I wasn't even there that night, Max. But someone said those things to my son. And you think it was Safi? Listen, Safi once threatened to turn Robbie against me. I know she's capable of it. Why would Robbie listen to her? Wait. Why would Robbie trust Safi? Does he even know her? She used to babysit for us, believe it or not. Robbie adored her. And none of this has anything to do with what happened to Safi's car? Something happened to her car? Never mind. Forget it. Look. I know she's your friend. I know you have no reason to believe me over her, but... Just give me a chance to get this shit in order first. Without her interfering. I just want to make sure my boy never has to hear anything like that again. This could all be a lie. One big smear campaign against Safi. But... Oh... What if it's not? I'm not sending it. I'll delete it. Okay, then deleted it. This is between you and her. None of my beeswax. Thank you. If I can't find any evidence to back this up, I don't even know. At least I have time to look. It's a restraining order. It's not like she's getting arrested. I think I've wrung all I can out of Lucas today. You can wrung stuff out of me. I'll... Hope Vin's that, back at his cool. desk now. I still have questions for that guy. Yeah, Vin, let's go talk about how you knew Safi's windshield was broken before I even said it was his windshield, her windshield. Time to follow up with Finn about that windshield slip. Let's see if I can't make this canary sing. Hey, you found it. Kudos. Max. Sorry to startle, just that was good luck finding it so fast. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. I... I'm, I'm such an idiot, I just left it on my desk. It's been that kind of day. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Something wrong with your phone? Fine. Did something happen to your phone while it was lost? Huh? Oh, uh, no, it's fine. I just can't get it unlocked. Fuck. It's gonna lock if I get it wrong again. This. It's not his phone. This is. It's not his phone. It's just someone Wait. else's phone. You can't remember your own code? I am like. extremely hungover. You're lucky I can remember who you are. You seemed fine out on the quad. I set the code to the year some old fucking magician scientist died. It slipped my mind. Magician scientist? <laughs> oh, Braxis shit. I must have thought it was cool at the time. I, can you just... I don't know. I'm not at my best right now. Sure. Yeah, that you stole someone's phone and you're trying to hack into it? Vin is definitely hiding something. Getting into that cell phone is my best shot at finding out what. Too hungover to remember a passcode? Jeez. Good thing I know another Vin. Yeah. 
<laughs> Same. A better one. A nicer one. So where do I... Here we go. Magic. I'm a magic scientist. A magician scientist. Uh, Vin's not here. Those look like they should be in a file folder somewhere. Jeez. Somebody robbed an airport lounge. Oh, look. Here he is. Fucking shit. Oh. Oh. Max. <laughs> yeah, you good? You look guilty. What can I do you for? What the fuck are you drinking? Oh. Are you drunk? Are you pouring whiskey into your coffee? Yes. Cool. Any particular reason why? World is a fuck. Etc. Etc. Join me. How many of those do you have? Ooh, just don't check the recycling. <laughs> Is this about Safi? Main's drinking at school. Safi, Safi, Safi. Everything is about Safi nowadays. This isn't about Safi, Max. This is about you and me. Right. Come on. Uh, illicit day drinking with your coworkers is. Sexy. Be sexy, Max. <laughs> Ew, what do I do? I kind of want to see Max be sexy, though. What, what harm could it do? Far be it for me to pass up an opportunity to accrue more sexy points. Uh, measuring sexiness with imaginary points. Not sexy. Mm, minus five sexy points to me, then. <laughs> Shouldn't we be hanging out on the train tracks? That's where all the kids drank in high school. <laughs> You're from the Pacific Northwest, aren't you? What's that like? Damp. A little damp. Occasionally torrential. What did you do when you weren't drinking on the train tracks? Took pictures, mostly. And? I swear, I'm not that interested. <laughs> I don't believe you. Um, rewinding time and shit like that. I like you, Max Caulfield. You okay, I made a bad decision. Haunted. <laughs> what? <laughs> don't worry, it's good. I don't feel comfortable. Somebody call. I need a restraining order on him. TV. In real life, haunted people have to live inside their haunted brains. Yeah. They do. <sighs> I actually really needed that. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Sharing is caring. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I bet. Hey, uh, Ben? Can I ask for something kind of weird? I don't do foot stuff. What? Damn. Well, there goes my Friday night. What? <laughs> foot stuff? Ben does owe me a favor. Ooh! I beg you. 
Save it for later. I don't know. If I call, if I call in my favor with them now, I can get access to that phone. But something more fucked up could happen later on. I don't know. I don't know. I kind of want to call it in. I low-key want to call it in. <sighs> Save it for later. I have a question. Do you know anything about a dead magician scientist? Jack Parsons? Occultist rocket scientist? Oh, maybe. What about him? Nothing, really. I just... They killed him, you know. Just like JFK. What? Oh. What, um, year did that happen? Hey. Any more questions, and I'll have to charge you. <sighs> wow. Right. Of course. Jack Parsons. Finally, Surely Jack Parsons. Place has a book on him somewhere. Well, we have a library just around the corner. We've got to find a when Jack Parsons died. That's the fourth bottle I've seen our fearless leader open this afternoon. Is he trying to act all grief stricken because his boss is killed? Here you go. Pretty sure Myvin said Jack Parsons was an occultist. So, history of the occult. Died June 17th, 1952. I'll look Vin's phone. Vin's not here. GG's. On the phone. Yeah, Jay. I hope this is the right code. 1952. Uh, success. I'm sorry, Vin. I know this is a brutal misuse of powers, but I need to know if you had anything to do with this. Food pics, food pics, mirror selfie, mirror selfie, shirtless mirror selfie. Oh no, we're gonna find nudes. Selfie. 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 There's a lot of selfie in here. I didn't get the impression they were close. Oh my god. Damn! Who even were you, Sophie? Damn, GG's. Yeah, it's GG's from here on out. I really thought I could help. Poke around a little, figure out who has it out for Sophie. Bada bing, bada boom. Case solved. Bada right? bing, bada boom. <laughs> Why else would my powers come back? Stupid. Now I have more impossible questions than I had to begin with. Lucas filing a restraining order? Vin and Sophie sleeping together? Gwen killing Sophie's book deal? I have no idea what any of it means. Everyone hates her, I guess. And the worst part is, I can't even talk to you about any of it. I won't be able to save you. Again. Whatever I do, it's going to turn out worse than I could even imagine. Get the fuck off me! I can't breathe. Why? I've heard those I've heard that, that line before.
Everyone stay back. Give him some space. Well, now she wants my help. He's having a panic attack or something. I'm not I... fucking crazy. I know what I saw up there. All right. An authority figure has arrived. Sort of. Nothing to worry about. Let's give him some space. What did you say up there? Can you run and get him some water? You okay, Reggie? <laughs> Am I okay? Fuck. What did you say? After what I just saw up there. What did you say? Reggie, up where? The fucking overlook. Yes, I know. I shouldn't have been up there. I'm a fucking idiot. I'm not mad. It's okay. I'm not mad. I just want to know what you were doing up there. Remember in your seminar how you said we should take photos of things that scare us? Uh, well, A plus for following directions then. No. You want to tell me what you saw? I say, if you saw someone getting um, piped down, I swear. I saw myself. Another me. Walking around. Working on the puzzle box. The, the one that I gave you earlier. What did this other you want? I wasn't going to fucking talk to him. I fucking ran, Max. Did you tell anyone what you saw? Did you tell... Loretta... Thank you. Can you take Reggie to the infirmary? Sure thing, Miss Caulfield. I'll see you later, yeah? Just make sure he's alright. Thanks, Max. So wait, does she have powers? Does he have powers too? What? Time to go back up there. I can handle this. He's not just gonna let me by, is he? Nope. Reach the crimes? Ah. Oh. Easy. Better start heading up to the Overlook. Hope there's a place to cross back over on the way. Does man know there's something called a mirror? Oh my god, facts! Imagine he just saw himself in a mirror. <laughs> oh, be right back. Oh, shit. I have some good news. Uh, big, but I can't tell you what it is. Why am I not at home wrapped up in a blanket burrito right oh, now? Oh, you have 24 hours before the world. What you so what's my original reality? Be able to make it up to the Overlook. Is, my, is Safi being dead, is that the original reality? Or her being alive is the original? I don't know. The hour of death. Get this bitch out of here. I know you. You know the owl. Congrats. No wonder Reggie had a panic attack. This goes against everything I learned in horror movies, but I should check for more weird shit. GG's. I want to go with the fact that the living world might be the original reality. This is my handwriting. Wait, am I the mystery photographer? Is, oh, is this from some other timeline? That is cool. 
If that's the fact, there's multiple timelines like crisscrossing Jesus over each other. Fuck! You've got to be kidding me. Do you think it was a student who didn't like their final grade? I doubt it. Usually those kinds pit me off with an angry, poorly written email. And do you know who did do this? Trying to avoid me, Max? Uh, trying not to bother you, actually. This is interesting. I don't smoke. Decline the joint. No thanks. Not for me. This actual work. Well, how would that have consequences? Now might be a good. Yeah, time the consequences to is I'm not going to suffer from lung cancer. Before I came out, I had this bar. Free thinker who adopted his worldview wholesale. Shout to you, do this. Hey! And a raging transport to boot. The brainwashing of kids. And of course, I was afraid if I said something, said anything, he'd figure me out. Oh wait, oh is he a trance? When I was alone, I had gone to the perfect soliloquy to shut him up. No, oh, I suppose that way uh she sounds like that. Because he was originally a he. Isn't there like a special word for that? In French, right? Let's free the we 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 met him with her. <laughs> I gave it your no. Oh yeah, that one's a Max Caulfield greatest hits. I don't speak French, even though my last name is French. It's ironic, isn't it? I've always been able to think of something to say eventually. What is that? Is that a vape? Like when? What is this? Video proof. Allegedly. Video proof of what? Trafficking of a controlled substance on campus. Hold on. There's no way Yasmin thinks you were selling drugs. How could she not? That there is security footage of someone who looks like me dealing to students. Someone who looks like you. Oh shit! So the different timelines are crossing it? over each other. It. Ow. That wasn't me, it was my evil twin. No. No. Fuck it. They've already made up their mind. You don't mean that. Thanks for believing in me, Max, but I'm sick of fighting to prove I deserve to be here. Oh, that is so cool. So, the different realities are crossing the over each other at his son, and affecting Reggie everything. Seeing himself here in the other timeline is Gwen another victim of doppelgangeritis, <laughs> or is she just trying to cover her ass? No. So, if I could look at that footage, maybe I could figure it out. Gwen, what are you? What are you doing? Saying goodbye. Fuck you! To Caledon! <laughs> to Yasmin! And to feeling powerless. You gotta take catharsis where you can get it. Save the footage. Save the footage. What the fuck? Gwen, listen. If I can just get a look at this footage, I might be able to help. I didn't ask for your help, Max. Jesus, I didn't even ask for your company. I just wanted to get stoned and watch that thing burn. 
Whatever. Do what you want. It's too cold for this shit. Quinn, wait. I need to ask you something. Did you hear about Safi's book? Is it true they canceled Safi's book deal? Oh, Jesus, Max. Have you ever tried not being so goddamn nosy? Wouldn't you want to know why? In my experience, some mysteries are better left. See if I can find what Reggie saw. Or thinks he saw. So that so if so if every if all the different realities are crossing over each other, that's cool. Cause I think that's what they're going for. Why are there flowers here? What the fuck? Oh. oh, she's hitting the roofies again. That is so weird. Oh, Miss Caulfield, you uh, out for a stroll too? Make that open with Reggie. Something like that. By the way, I appreciated your help with Reggie. Oh. That it was the least I could do. Reggie's a sweetheart. Oh, she has a crush on him. GG's. Holy shit, what are those? No idea. You can see those? Yeah. Do you think this is what Reggie saw? No, he saw himself, wish I could say. That's not really mine to share. I, I'm not trying to... I just want to make sure he's okay. Honest. He will be. I think. I was going to come up here anyway after the suicide tip, but... Seeing Reggie like that... I don't know. Made it feel... Real. Wait. Suicide tip? One of the B cops let it slip. You run a successful podcast for a few years and you find ways to get people to open up. Speaking of opening up, I got a lead. I could cut you in. What's the catch? One second I'm a source and the next I'm a fellow investigator. It sounds like there's strings attached. No! It's not like that. It's not? I just... I feel like I kind of owe you after the whole interview thing. Maya Okada, one of Safi's classmates during undergrad. They were friends. Then... Maya died a couple years back. Okay. Suicide. Apparently. Pattern? You think it's a pattern? Maybe. Yeah. Two promising young writers, both dead, both by their own hand, according to official sources. But Safi didn't kill herself. Like I said, a pattern. Maybe. Explain something to me. Why is this so important to you? Safi was my friend. Because I hate it when things don't make sense. Facts. Same. Like, I'm, I'm hating this right now. This makes zero sense. And I want to... Oh, for, oh, for a second there, I thought my... I, I was I messaging myself. I thought it was me messaging myself from a, another timeline. It's just Moses. It's just Drake.
It's just P. Diddy Jr. Who's he? Text. Tried calling, but he didn't pick up. It's cool, Max. Everything's cool. It's not cool, though. It is not. How bad is it? So what's the damage? What's the LDR version? Pretty sure I'm the number one suspect. What? Why? Besides that being true for most of my life? Well, I did... I did do something. What? I took Sophie's camera. Why? That's evidence. Moses, why did you? It wasn't like a rational decision. I wasn't thinking. I just. When we found her that night, I saw the camera. And I thought the last picture she took in her life was that selfie of the three of us. Oh, uh, that is. Okay. Sophie would never want to have that camera, that picture. In the hands of the fucking police. So I brought it back to my office. And then I realized, what the fuck am I doing? That's evidence in a murder case. So I just hid it in there. In my office. Moses. I screwed up. I don't know what to do. Tell him the truth. All right. Maintenance tech is on his way to unlock your office, Mr. Murphy. Then I'll just have a look around inside. Shit. I've got to get Sophie's camera out of there. Somehow. Unless you have a key card. Miss Coffee. And you all? Sorry, I don't think we've been introduced. Mr. That's Detective. Detective Vince Alderman with the Vermont State Police. I'll be handling your friend Sophia's case from now on. Okay. I'm sorry for your loss, by the way. I don't trust him. We. There a problem here? So, is there some kind of problem here, Detective? Max, it's okay. Not a problem. A slight hiccup. Mr. Murphy, apparently, gets his key card quite often. That's true. He does. Miss Caulfield, I do need you to leave the area for the time being. Will you be okay? Mr. Murphy will be fine. Oh, shut up. This guy, I'm, I want to slap Please. this guy. His, fa his face looks very punchable. Okay, now's my chance to get into Moses' office. Where's a place I can shift to the other timeline? Right there. Maybe I can find a way into Moses' office from this side. I'm really want I really want to know what the original timeline is. It's interesting. 
Uh, it's over here, right? Here we go. Hey, maybe this Moses can help me find the camera. This Moses wouldn't have it. Oh, hey Max. Man, that's annoying. How do you stand it? You'd be surprised how quickly you get used to it. I think they call that Stockholm Syndrome. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. So, what's up? Actually, I need to ask you kind of a weird question. My favorite kind. Name it. Drugs. Hiding spots. Kind of left field, but if you were going to hide something personal in this lab, where would you put it? If this is about my dream diary, trust me, you'll never find it. I'd never bring it to campus. Dream diary? You never told me you keep a dream diary. And I never will. Pure conjecture on your part. Damn, okay. What is your most prized possession? In here, at least. In here? Uh, probably that mug. My sister made it for me as an early Christmas gift. Oh. That's sweet. Remind me not to get you any mugs for Christmas. Yeah, jeez. W... L Max. Okay. Name something in here you wouldn't want, say, Dr. Fire to find. Like, something I keep locked away? Yes. Yes, exactly. That would definitely be my electric kettle. Maintenance has no idea where I hide that fire hazard. As I live and breathe. Moses Murphy. Rule breaker. Rule bender, Max. Rule bender. Yeah, rule bender. I'm pretty anyway, sure the court won't see it that way. Oh. Moses. You need to hold something, or can I help somehow? Actually, yeah. I need an Allen wrench. I don't know what that is. I'm joking. I don't know exactly what that is. Here? No, I borrowed one from Carla, but I think she took it back. If you can go grab that from her, I'll owe you. Okay. Okay, let's go get the Allen wrench for Drake. I can't go looking around for Carla. I need a faster way to get Moses a wrench. Where can I shapeshift in here? Here we go. No one's been here for days. That's new. You don't want to look out the window. You could okay. get in trouble. Electric cuddle. I need to get that Allen wrench, and I need to be quick. <sighs> what? Bitch, you did not just... Relax. It was a picture of the mugs you two were drinking out of. Good. Oh, I would rather murder all my students with my bare hands than grade one more final. Well, no. Were you two up all night? Yeah. There we go. And... I'll be working on these astronomy finals until sundown. What I get get this wrench to all my Okay, too many Maxes talking at once. All of this. Wait, so where's this kettle? Better give this wrench to Moses. Well, yo, wait, donuts? Yo! Oh, cozy little donut corner. Yo, you probably want to close the box, though. The donut's going to dry out. No one likes a... No one likes a dry uh, donut. Better give this wrench to Moses. 
So I found this guy named Alan, but he didn't know anything about a wrench. No, Max, not literally Alan. It's... Oh. <laughs> you are a life. Oh my god, he didn't get the pun. Dad joke aside. I'll never apologize for my dad jokes. And you're welcome. Mural goes here. What's that about? Safi's baby. She had the bright idea that we should draw the Gemini twins up there. You draw? I didn't know you had an artistic side. Long dormant. Comes with being the only scientist in a family of artsy fartsy types. Anyway, I'm sure we'll get to it at some point. We have all the time in the world. So, did you want some tea? Um, yeah, if you don't mind. W with the contraband kettle, right? Yeah, I want that contraband kettle. Just give me just a sec. Sure. So the cabinet is a secret hiding spot. Let's hope the other Moses hid the camera in the same place. Okay, let's go back into the other reality. That's still annoying. That Optimus Prime on his, de on his desk? Yo, is that Deadpool? wasn't here in the other timeline. That can't be a coincidence. I'm just saying. Is this where he hid Sophie's camera? Okay, the camera might be under a safe. Where can I find this safe? No idea. Obviously. Thought the safe might be behind the box? I don't know of any other safes in Moses' office. Think I might need his help again. Can I not put the oh key back? God. Stop! Will it distract you if I talk? Should be fine. What's up? Another strange question. Um, you don't have a safe in here, do you? The locking kind? No. Are there non-locking safes? Uh, well, for a second, I thought you were asking about the star safe. S A I P H. There's a star called Safe. Sure is. It's a part of the Orion constellation. That is a pretty cool looking kettle. What the? You've been popcorned. <laughs> Engineering wants a prank war. I'm trying not to sink to their level. <laughs> Gonna go clean this up. Uh, if they want a prank war, we'll give them a fucking so prank war. We'll the camera under a star. And of course, there are stars oh, everywhere. Why is it so happy? If 
and they're safe on the lower left. No camera. Must not be the right safe. Oh, they're a good kind? Like... They're safe. Please let this mean I'm one step closer to the camera. Right, because that would have been too easy. Uh, now what? Moses was so excited when this came out. I feel like I understand this now. Maybe I've gotten smarter with age. Maybe Moses was thinking of safe when he drew this? At least Moses hid the camera well. Wherever it is. I'm gonna get this dude arrested by accident, aren't I? Anime! to be a tiny plant in a vial. Protected by a team of high-tech androids. So safe is actually the star safe. Only <laughs> Moses. Yeah, I'm lost. Throw me a bone at this point. Wait, maybe? Maybe? Come on, Moses. Where did you hide it? The only other place I can think of is upstairs. The mural. Moses must have projected some stars to use as a guide. Moses said safe is part of Orion. Maybe Orion was projected on the wall that night. I need to set this up exactly how Moses had it when he was drawing. Fucking, oh my god. Um. Yo, I'm not a fucking rocket scientist. I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe, wait, maybe. I think I got it. Oh, there we go. Fingers crossed I can find safe on that wall. Safe is right here. So if this is Orion, then safe is boom good job finding safe max why thank you max now then there we go oh fuck no 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 Shit, I can't let him see me in here. I'm so close to getting Safi's camera. If I can just distract him for a few minutes, I think I can grab it. I'll need something noisy. Noisy? Um... Me on a Friday night, am I right? I'm sorry. Um, I don't know what would be noisy. Good thing I can keep an eye on Alderman from here. Wouldn't want to show up right in front of him. Plant the distraction. Oh, I can actually see him. Um, let's 
So if he's here... I need to make sure Alderman won't see me when I shift into that timeline. Oh, I have to go back into the timeline. Yeah, wait for him to leave. Oh. What the hell? Shit. Did I just fuck up? Did I just? Did I just rewind time? To get up to the nest. Okay. Let's try this again. Weird. I think this is the same telescope Moses is working on in the other world. But how? I'm a sneaky little bitch. You can't find me. You'll never find me. This dude, this dude, don't, 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 don't. So that's why they're the shift point up here. Here goes. What the hell? And now I need to shift out of here fast. Time to finally get what I came here for in the first place. Grab Safi's camera, yep. Hey, is someone down there? Stupid telescope. Why couldn't Moses have put you together in this timeline? Uh, what is she doing? Why is it glowing? What? what the, the actual fuck? fuck? What in the actual hell? Yes. Holy shit. The telescope and all the parts switched places. I should probably fix this, right? Gotta run. Sorry, I... I'll text you. Yo. What? Yeah, he won't be questioning me. Hmm. 
Move it. Huh. He liked you again. Miss Caulfield. I speak with you for a minute. You should go. Please. Have a seat. Oh, this is going to end badly, isn't it? I just wanted you to have a chance to talk to me alone. Because Miss Llewellyn was a close friend of yours. Okay. We have a sensitive situation. We know Miss Llewellyn's camera was taken by someone closely linked to her death. Now, I'm pretty certain I know who took it and why. Maybe you've even guessed my thinking. But if we're going to make any progress on your friend's case... I took it! That's not enough. Therefore, I'm asking you if you have or come by any information about this person or where they've taken the camera. Can I trust you to let me know? Should I just tell him I have the camera now? Agree. Sure. Of course. If I notice anything, I'll let you know. I'm glad to hear it. And I'm sure Dr. Fayed would be grateful as well. Now that is my direct number. No detail is too small to share. You're, you're not bothering me. You're helping your friend's case. So he really, he Thanks does. again for your time, Miss Caulfield. Have a good day. Magic. Okay, let's download Safi's photos onto your computer, yeah? Go ahead. I need a minute to get my thoughts in order. I'll join you soon. Okay. Yeah, because I just broke multiple laws just then. I even broke the laws of physics. I somehow went whoosh, and somehow magically Wait, I swapped shit. Is that? Wilder Beasts and These by Lucas Colmenero. <laughs> Figures there'd be copies all over campus. Might as well add it to my collection of so-called clues. I picked up so many things today. Best lay it all out and see if it gets me anywhere. With the clues, here we go. Okay, Max. Let's see what we've got. This was meant to be a loud message, but from who? And what does it mean? It can't be from it, what it, I. I don't know who did that then. While I do want to see this so-called incriminating footage of Gwen, yeah. it's probably best to wait till Moses leaves to check it. Well, I kind of already. I probably shouldn't leave all this out in the open. Maybe in the if dark I sit room. Away for a bit, these all make sense later. Is uh Jefferson back? 
Because I'm pretty sure the dark room is like a bad bad a no no room. Is doing all right. I should go see if and is that magic of the gathering hooked up yet? Where's the dark room? Oh, here we go. Yo, this whole this whole room just screams killer. Moses, you okay? Is it weird that I'm low-key nervous about seeing Safi's, you know, final pictures? Far from it. Safi was special to us, to everyone. But I meant, are you okay, okay? I've been better. I'm not actually going to cooperate. I apologize for what I said to that detective. You have to know I wasn't being serious. I was only trying to... Take the easy way? It's nice when you have that option. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. Oh, I should have refused. Hey, look. Maybe seeing Safi again will help clear the air. Hard to believe it would be the last time we were all together. That's the truth. What a crew we were. Hey, look. She took one more photo. Sneaky girl. What? 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 What's going on? What is this? What? Max, you... You killed her? not so that that it's photoshop a deep fake maybe i don't know you sold me out to own me you were covering for yourself no moses please this is me you're talking about me there's a lot i don't know about you but you know i wouldn't do something like that i could never Stay the fuck away from me. Yo. What? Yo, that's not me. Famous words of Andrew Garfield, that's not me. It's not me. It's not me. Clearly she's wearing the, the... I was wearing those clothes that night. Obviously, I was wearing a red beanie. Okay. Save the footage, okay. Ah, fuck. Should I change a different? Should I try a different outfit? Yo, let's go. Let's go, Kitty. Let's go, Kitty. Oh, that's an orange hill. 
Because that's the outfit she was wearing. I was wearing this. See, this is why this is why I said she should just fuck the dead timeline and go live in the the living reality. This makes about as much sense as it did last night. Let's take a look at the evidence for the kajillionth time. I've got to be missing something. No matter Actually, I am just going to leave the stream here. I'll be back tomorrow night, 7pm Australian time. Uh, go make sure to go check out my socials and my YouTube. Uh, until then, stay safe.